Hey, one straight here. Thank you. It's going to be my first show that I'll be playing while being pregnant. So that's going to have, you know, that's going to have its own female centric vibe about it. Um, and there's going to be lots of just strong messages and, and um, through the music and through, I, I think, through the show. Okay. Yeah, beautiful. Thank you. Uh, yeah, I'm actually just getting into the stadium for the first time today and realizing the uh, reality that it's a big deal tomorrow. <laughs> um, I, I, you know, I got the opportunity to play the Super Bowl and that was a big stadium show and it was televised, so I'm glad I had that rehearsal. Um, I'm definitely, I definitely have like, you know, a little less breath right now. Um, so uh, I'm excited to bring the music. Would that be the largest crowd though, 90,000? Uh, for any female sporting event, for sure. Anything female related, for sure, yeah. I'm glad, I mean, I'm hoping, I'm hearing the ticket number, um, you know, over the past couple of days is going up steadily and especially with who's now playing, which is so exciting. I mean, that's the biggest cricket game in the world right there, female or not. Absolutely. Yeah. Okay. Well, start down here again. So there's camaraderie and community, which is pretty scarce these days. And so I, I feel like it's a lot like music and that's why I love it. I mean, I should probably learn. I'm probably going to get all of the cricket sayings wrong too. Yeah. Yeah, thank you. All right, let's do the trophy now. Cool. I mean, how great is it? It's on like International Women's Day and it's female cricket. It's like, are we living in a simulation? <laughs> or is this just how God is like, saying, hey, let's all come together and lift up women and support them like they should be. Yeah. Thanks. So I'm walking past. Yeah, yeah. Just look at each other for a while, for a minute, okay? We're in love. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, yeah. You know no doubt we're in a, a different spot uh, now than we were heading into the first game. I think we're uh, very well prepared for what tomorrow will throw at us. Uh, it hasn't been an easy road to the final, but I wouldn't have had it any other way. Uh, we're sort of match and battle hardened, really. All our games, you know, the last four games have been cutthroat, uh, must win clashes, and they've all been close. So we've had to deal with that pressure and uh, need to sort of stand up when you're under the pump. And I've been extremely pr proud of how the group's handled that so far. And we've got one more of those games to go. It's, it's going to be a really tough, hard battle tomorrow against India, who are a great side. But I feel like we're as ready as we can be to, to take that on. Yeah. Yes. Well, I'm going to get her back now. So we just had to play this area. Yeah, 31. 31. Oh wow! You can do it for her. Yes. Uh, yes, we didn't get uh, get that much outdoors or uh, definitely uh, important game, but uh, we we all were in in the touch. We all were doing indoors. I know they are not that much uh, uh, like the, the they are not something you give you the like full confidence because uh, surface totally di different. But everybody was in great touch. Everybody was there to to uh, uh, to think what they they need to do for the team. And uh, uh, and uh, with that we definitely got uh, that rest also because when you're playing for a long time uh, you you need some a break from. Uh, uh, from from the cricket also, but uh, I think uh, uh, still everybody was so keen and uh, nobody wanted to take rest and because this this time is very important for us.